Hi, I'm Rick Feldman with Gardens by Rick, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to get your soil nice and acidic for your hydrangeas. Okay, here you are at the site where you're going to plant some of your hydrangeas. Uh, they do like acidic soil, so you want to make sure that it is ready for them. You want to first check to see what you're starting with. Get your pH reading on the soil that you have there prior to um, starting your soil mixture. Uh, once you establish what you have here, um, it looks like we have an average of a uh, seven. That's pretty much the average of most soil. We want that a little bit higher in acidity and less alkaline. And the lower the number, the more acid is in the soil. So that being said, we're going to add some acidic grow mulch. Always use natural organic grow mulch. Um, nothing scientifically created. It's much better for um, the, uh, the plants if you use organics. Uh, use the organic grow mulch, mix it in at about a 50-50% um, uh, percentage. You want to mix this grow mulch in with your existing soil so that it creates a very uh, acidic soil that the hydrangeas tend to enjoy. And you mix it in together. If it's soft like this, you're able to use hands. Um, if not, if it's a hard soil you have to bring out tools to work in the soil that you might need based on the uh, type of soil you have. So you mix it in, take another pH reading, make sure you're at about six and a half, six, uh, and you're ready for your hydrangeas. And as a side note, as you're planting for your hydrangeas, if you have the blue variety, they will only remain blue for that first year. The rest of the years after, those blooms will become lighter. So what you need to do is add a bluing, there's a special hydrangea bluing agent that you can purchase and literally just apply it to the hydrangeas uh, and that will keep the flowers absolutely dark blue. Again, I'm Rick Feldman with Gardens by Rick and that is how you prepare your soil for hydrangeas.